boy, I got a lot out of my fucking mouth. Hey guys, we're back. So last time I just talked, we went to this chapter. King uh, fucking Anakinos fucking tried to kill us before we came to kill him with the both Norian and Hoshin army on our side. Scarlet said, you ain't gonna kill him, and fucking took a bullet for us. Also, in the last video, I explained um, what was going on, what's my reasoning for the upload schedule for a certain Let's Play, why I didn't want to play Birthright, and now we're gonna get into it. Oh my god, fucking Scarlet. <sighs> Scarlet, I don't hate you. You dying right now is the reason why I can never go back to playing Birthright, because I know that if I go and play Birthright and play this again, that it just makes me fucking sad. It makes me depressed, because I'm like, what's the fucking worth? Like, why do I want to fucking make myself more crying? Like, fuck, man. Ahem. Now you talk game. Scarlet? Fucking Christ. No, this can't be. Scarlet? Answer me. Scarlet? Oh, that bitch is dead. You can't die now. Don't give up. Scarlet! Okay, do you want to hear the worst part? Of why... I don't like this scene and why I can go to birthright. Scarlet is a marriage candidate for Corrin. So if I fucking did this, married her off screen and did the fucking support conversations, this scene would be a lot more emotional. And I did this first time revelation, not knowing this happened. And I married Scarlet and Corrin together. And this cutscene happened. Which made me sole reason why I never wanted to touch Birthright ever again. Because of that reason. And, again, I played Birthright so many times, I don't even want to fucking play it anymore. I don't want to hear it anymore. If I want to fucking watch it, I'll, want to, I'll fucking watch it. But I just like Conquest and Revelation, in my opinion. They're, I like those games and stories better. To the point where I can play them. Regardless, let's continue. Oh, Scarlet. How am I gonna tell Ryoma? Well, shit. What the enemies? I've been spotted already? Oh, look. Xander and Ryoma. Xander, Ryoma. Don't let your... Don't let down your guard. This area is crawling with enemies. More are coming. There's Gunter. And Azura. You all made it. I'm glad to see you safe, Dry. Over there. Who is that? It's that mage we've met from like back from like all the chapters ago oh that mage must be the one summoning all these enemies then we need to fight through them and take her out Oh, more supports. Awesome. Great. Okay. Now I need to be careful of who I put in. Okay, I know who I want to put in. So I'll keep Mozu in this guy. Now, yeah, you see Gunther. He's level 30. Uh, sure is level 20. I wanted to max them out as soon as possible. Uh... Not them, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. I'll get these guys in. 
Yeah, I'll do Arthur, Kagro, Silas, and Felicia. Give me a moment. Oh, fuck. What do I want to do? Wait, I know. Azama Effie. Yeah, Ryoma and Elise, sure. Do I want to put Anna? Or... Oh, fuck. So now I'm in a funk. So I would choose between Reyna or Anna. Mm. Yeah. Reyna. Alright. View map. Let's pair people together. Hold on. And then together. Jack up and Mozu. Okay, girl. And Arthur. Yep. Pair you up over here. Put you over there. Put you right there. And yep, right there. Let's go. It looks like this sigil is the center is protected by this sturdy barrier. I sense dragon veins nearby, in the eight forts. Use those to remove the barrier. Be careful. We need to split up in order to activate activate each dragon vein. So yeah, there is a dragon vein in each fucking area. And only three out of all of us have Dragon Mane, so this is going to be more interesting. So I'll put my character to start. Ryoma will start over here and go down along with that. So, Elise, attack. I want you to get better at your fucking magic, so here we go. Yes, the fucking accessories. Don't ask why. The fucking units in the fucking goddamn camp want fucking accessories, so they're gonna weird, weird shit. Okay. Now, who's gonna go with who? Azama and Effie are gonna go with me. Oh, shit. Oh, we got a Zama fucking silence the mage. Do it. Good, he's getting experience. Better that way. So he's almost like B in fucking um, stabs. Okay, I need to get something extracted. Arthur and Kegro go with my character. And we can have. Yeah, yeah, we can have Kegro fucking kill this bastard. It is TOI time, Arthur. We're gonna fucking murder this fuck. No chance. Bye, fucker. Stood no chance. Let's fucking go, BB. Okay. Mozu and Jackup will go up here and support Elise and Ryoma. So will Silas and Felicia. Nice, Kegro grew a level. Oh, fucking disgusting. Oh, they're coming. So, we can go down there, and when we need to go across those two. Now, this is where planning has to go in effect. Dragon Vein number one. That's one dragon vein activated. Seven left to go. Yeah, Jacob needs more fucking levels. So 
Solias. Dragon Staff. Yup. And with that, I'll catch you guys in the next video where we continue this shit. Alright, peace.